Hello YouTube, I'm back again and welcome to my channel, The Late Grower. Now, this is the uh, second part of my uh, video on growing papaya in containers. And uh, this time, I will show you uh, a method that I use in order to keep this papaya short. You see, ito pong papaya na ito, uh, yung fruit niya, nakukuha ko sa puno na about 15 meters, or sorry, 15 feet in height. So, it's really a quite uh, papaya quite tall papaya tree so in this case since they are growing in a container I have to make sure that they will not really grow too tall and uh, since naka contain nga siya they're not really supposed to grow tall but at the same time pwede ko pa siyang uh, paliitin and one method that I'm using is yung pag, uh, pag uh, prune or pag uh, tap ng uh, papaya tree so in this case ito pong isang ito uh, naiprune ko na to ng dalawang beses so ito po yung una I don't know if you can see itong guhit na ito ito yung unang pagkakaprune ko sa kanya and then ang pangalawa naman ay itong portion na ito I don't know if you can see this ito pong portion na ito yung uh, pangalawa kita nyo yung guhit yan and uh, what I noticed was that every time I uh, tap ito tumataba yung kanyang ano yung kanyang uh, main stem so nagiging stocky siya now uh, since I uh, pruned it last time may tumaas na po siya ulit ng about 5 inches so kailangan ko na naman siyang i-prune and this time I will prune all of them you see some of these uh, the rest actually have not yet been uh, pruned or uh, topped off so uh, today I will top all of them and I want to show you how Yung pagtap ko po dito, ito lang pinaka-growth niya sa itaas ang pinuprun ko, ang pinuprun ko. Slightly angled po ang ano, ang scissor. Ganyan lang po. Ayan. So, natap na po siya. Ito pong isang ito, hindi pa natatap. So, as you can see, payat yung kanyang ano, yung kanyang uh, main stem. So, gusto ko rin tumaba siya, maging stocky at huwag masyadong bigla na lang siyang tataas. So, ipuprun ko rin siya. I will also prune it like this. So, yung top lang po. So, this is what we can call topping. Uh, some call it pruning, others call it topping. Ito pong isa, yung top din ang tinanggal ko sa kanya. Okay? This one, also first time po ito na matatap. So, ayan, natap off na po siya. So, this is one method that uh, you can use to uh, keep your papaya uh, short. In the case of uh, mature papaya trees, ang nangyayari po, nagbabranch out sila pagka mature na yung papaya, tapos eh, pinutol mo, nagbabranch out sila. Nag nagiging magkasanga, halimbawa. But these are still relatively young papaya trees. So, ang gagawin lang po siguro nila muna ay eh, magpapalaki ng kanilang ano, uh, main trunk. Kaya kagaya na nangyari dito. Hindi siya nagbranch out pa. Actually, meron na pala siya dito. Oh. Ayan, nag-umpisa na siya ang branch out dito. So, one way of uh, making it uh, branch out, ito po, yung pareho nito. Nag-umpisa na pala siya. Pero, at the same time, siguro, kailangan muna niyang ma-reach yung mas malaki-laking trunk. Pareho na nangyari dito. Ito po, baka hindi pa mag-branch out ito. Hopefully, sana mag-branch out din siya. Okay? So, this is one way of uh, keeping your papaya tree short in order to manage their uh, height. Now, uh, last video, I also showed you a newly transplanted papaya tree. As you can see right now, it lost all of its leaves already, pero meron naman siyang buhay na, ano, na leaves at meron siyang bagong growth. So, this papaya has already survived the uh, stress of getting transplanted. And in a few days, back to full health na po ito. Okay, thank you very much for watching. In my next video on my uh, papaya uh, in containers, I will show you how to water them. Okay, so see you in my next video. Bye-bye!